and welcome. This video will speak to the newly introduced Plant PAX 5.0 Highly Integrated Heart feature. With Plant PAX 5.0 and Highly Integrated Heart, we have improved the workflow to integrate heart devices within the new Plant PAX process controller. The software we will be using within this tutorial is Factory Talk View Studio SE version 12, and this new feature is only available to the new process controllers of the Logix controller family version 33 and above. To begin, I have an open Studio 5000 project connected to a pre-configured process controller. Next, I will navigate to the process controller IO tree and highlight a heart device with the tag name TI5000. In this example, an Endris Hauser Trust Sense temperature sensor connected to a new heart analog input module 5094-IF8IH. This allows you to show status, configure the devices, and make online changes to the devices. To demonstrate, the new features of the 5094 heart input module and the process objects, I will configure a new heart device within the IO tree while we are online. To add a new device, right click on the heart communication bus under the 5094 heart module and select discover modules. All connected heart devices will be auto-discovered. You can also add devices manually. Select the device and press Create. As you can see, the module will read the device information, Endris Hauser Delta Pilot M, and the tag name PI4000, automatically via heart communication from the device. We will now edit the module definition by pressing Change next to the connection. We're able to select a planned PAX data connection. This is a pre-configured data type to match the new PAH, Process Analog Heart Embedded Process Object Instruction. Beside the four dynamic heart variables, PV, SV, TV, and QV, users can add additional device variables specific. I will add, for example, an additional sensor temperature variable. Furthermore, users can add additional commands defined via the device's EDD file. Following the configuration, we will press OK on the module definition window. Press Yes on Change Module Definition. Finalize configuration of the module by selecting OK on the new module definition box along with the general window. Click Yes to create the new module online. Following the configuration of the device along with additional commands, I would like to highlight the resulting tag structure. Navigate to the controller's tag browser. Search for the device's tag name that was configured, PI4000. Next, expand the tag structure and highlight the device tag name, PI4000 PAX device input table. As you can see, we have three members. These members are utilized within the control strategy along with the analog input and smart device faceplate. The first one is the new plant PAX data type along with the additional variables and command that were configured. All these members are then utilized within the process analog input strategy, along with the faceplates. Next, I will navigate to a pre-configured routine that includes the process input strategy. Here, you can see the PAH, process analog heart, instruction tied directly to the PAI, process analog input instruction. What is shown in this function block diagram is the process analog input control strategy that is pre-configured and ready for use via the process object library download. As you can see in the PAH instruction, there is the reference to the PI4000 device input table. This corresponds to the configured device. Lastly, I will highlight the HMI features of highly integrated heart. On this display, I have a PAI global object that is tied to our PI4000 PAI control strategy shown in the previous steps. To start, I will click on the global object to launch the PAI faceplate. To access the heart faceplate button, navigate to the maintenance tab and press the smart device faceplate button. Within the smart device faceplate, there are three tabs, operator, maintenance, and diagnostics. Within the operator tab, we show the heart device's variables and corresponding values along with the device's status. Next tab is the maintenance tab, which includes the description and the tag of the device. 
Following that, we will select the Display Advanced Properties Navigation button. Within the HMI tab of this window, configuration of the PAH block can be modified if the user has the correct access level. Select HMI Configuration. This gives the user with the proper rights the ability to change the labels, decimal places, etc. Lastly, we will navigate to the diagnostic screen, which shows the device's status along with the active diagnostics. After viewing this video, you should come away with the following information. Ease of integration between heart devices and plant PAX's process objects, along with plant PAX heart process object HMI features that are included in plant PAX 5.0. Remember, you'll need Factory Talk View Studio SE version 12, process controllers of the Logix controller family version 33 and above, and a 5094 heart enabled input or output module. For more information on the highly integrated heart feature or planned PAX 5.0, please contact your local Rockwell Automation representative. Thank you.